近くに警察がいるみたいだな今夜は外には出ない方がいい。この店は俺がアジトのように使ってる店だ。警察とは繋がってない。安心しろ。どうして？うん？どうして私のこと、かくまうようなこと？この店特製ブレンドの中国茶だその辺の適当な茶とは味が違う。とりあえずそれでも飲んで落ち着け。あなた、警察の人なんでしょそうだ。さっき柴田が話していたこと聞いてたんでしょうああ聞いてたじゃあどうして簡単だ俺は生活安全課の刑事だからだ殺しは専門じゃないでもそれにたとえあんたが殺人をやっていたとしても俺にはあんたを捕まえることができないんだ殺人の証拠がないからなだから証拠が揃うまではこうして身柄を拘束するしかないまあ任意同行に付き合ってるくらいに思っといてくれどうして私の身柄をあなたの目的は何なの俺はずっとあんたを探していた10年前からずっとな今から25年前1985年4月30日あんたは俺の親父と会う予定になっていたこの日の夜親父は荒川から水死体となって発見されたえ佐江島康子さん刑事としてじゃない父親を殺された一人の男としてあんたに聞きたいあの日あんたと親父は何を話したんだ教えてくれ。You're his son.What did you and my father talk about the day he was killed?Nothing. I waited for him.Detective Tanamura, your father never came.He didn't show?No. I was supposed to meet him at a Camarocho cafe in the early afternoon. But he called in the morning and asked me to meet him that evening instead. That evening? Did he say why? I don't remember exactly. But he said the hit was a setup. He said, Your brother was the trigger man, but not the real perpetrator. I'll have proof of it soon, so hang tight. The real perp. And he was on. To their identity. Before he hung up, he said the hit wasn't part of a clan war, that it was the work of a much greater force. He told me to be careful. A greater force? I never figured out what he meant by that. But when your father never showed up, I got scared. I left Camarocho immediately. I see. I can't blame you. So your father was. You think because of his investigation of that case, someone. <laughs> Looks like it. But what you just told me shed some new light on some things. It did? I always thought my father's murderer was either a Tojo or an Ueno Saiwa man. But something just didn't seem right. Not right. A cop killing normally raises a firestorm in the force. An extra thorough investigation always follows because it's one of our own. But my father's death was classified as accidental, even though it was clearly murder. That just doesn't happen. Do you think that greater force your father mentioned killed him? During his investigation, he must have stumbled onto something big. If that's true, 
This whole thing's even scarier than I thought. Now back to you, Yasuko. I come back after 25 years. And why are you knocking off Shibata family members? Does it have something to do with your brother? Don't worry. Even if you tell me the truth, the police won't do a thing. None of my superiors are likely to believe a word I say. Please, tell me. A man named Katsuragi from the Ueno Saiwa clan said... He said, I'll save your brother if you either bring me a hundred million, or kill someone. Katsuragi? Wait, how'd this happen? It started a few months ago. I was living out in Chiba when I got a call from a man claiming to be a detective in Tokyo. He said, someone might be able to save your brother. I'll introduce you to him. Someone from the police said that? Yes. Because it was the police, I never thought to question it, so I rushed to Kamurocho to meet this person. And it turned out to be Katsuragi. Yes. What did Katsuragi say to you? He told me... He was one of the victims at the scene 25 years ago. And if he testified that Tiger wasn't the killer, the case would have to be re-examined. If that happened, Tiger stood a chance of getting released. All for the price tag of a hundred million yen or murder? Yes, but a hundred million is such an impossible sum of money. So you chose murder. Why did Katsuragi send you after people connected to the Shibata family? He didn't mention anything about them belonging to the Shibata family, but... But? He said eliminating certain individuals would help prove my brother's innocence. Certain individuals. Now I think he wanted to silence the people who knew the truth about what happened. なるほどな。これで一つ見えてきたな。25年前の事件、カツラギとシバタは裏で繋がっていた。おそらくシバタは25年前のことをエサに今もカツラギを落としていた。だからカツラギと協力関係にあったアライに殺された。西島大河が行った上野義晴襲撃事件にはもっと裏があるはずだ。問題はどうしてあの荒井がカツラギと手を組んだのかだ。まさかこの前起こったあの抗争事件ってのもああ、最初から仕組まれたもんだった可能性が
あなただけじゃないのよ寂しい思いをしているのは全員憎いヤクザも警察も桂木も真犯人なんてどうでもいい私はもう一回お兄ちゃんに会いたいそれだけなの。Yes, it does. I need your help, please. You won't have to kill anyone else. I give you, I'll give my life to reunite you with your brother.、No. He is no different than you are. All he wants is justice for the murder of the father he loved. Can you find it in your heart to help him? Please look at me. I'll help you. Y Yasuko! This is. Kamuro Chuo Parking. There is a car that is in there. その車のトランクの中に1億円入っていますえ私は桂木の命令に従って罪を犯しました最初は1人か2人殺せばいいと思ってたけど桂木の要求は止まらなかった次から次へ人を殺すよう私に命令してきたでも私はもう人を殺せなかった殺したくなかっただから借りたんです誰にですかスカイファイナンスの秋山さんって方に借りましたスカイファイナンスそのお金はあなたに預けますもし桂木がその1億円で兄の無実を証言してくれると言ったらそのお金を渡してくださいそれはわかるんですがどうして私に私は今から沖縄に行きます今からですかあさってが兄の死刑執行日なんです兄が前にいた東京刑務所の刑務官の方が教えてくれましたお兄さん今沖縄の刑務所にはいつい先日移送されたみたいですあくまで内密にということで教えてくれました多分私が25年間毎日面会に通い続けたからですね結局一度も会えませんでしたけど25年間毎日もう時間がないんですだからもし死刑執行が止められなかった時はせめてお兄ちゃんの近くにいたい私は谷村さんを信じるしかありませんどうか兄のことよろしくお願いしますOh, damn, Tanamura! We got quite our work cut out for us now. But we need to do it for her and her brother's sake. Which is actually kind of interesting because now we're starting to see all the different characters starting to get、um, name dropped to each other. So I'm seeing possibilities for meetups in the future, which is actually really exciting for me. But anyway. Now that we got a quite good、um, pause in the storyline, I say that.、Um, circle X. The, what? Dollar.、Uh, excuse me? Uh, do you understand any Japanese? Maybe even a little English? Nope, not even gonna try and translate that. That's no use. She doesn't understand a word I say. 
What's going on here? Oh, Tanamura! You couldn't have come at a better time. Is there a problem? No, but it sounds like this woman is looking for someone. But she can't speak Japanese, so I'm really not sure what to do. I was trying to get her to follow me back to the station so we could have an interpreter help us, but she doesn't seem keen on leaving this spot. I see. I'll take things from here. Thanks for your help, Tanamura. No worries. If you had taken her to the station, I would have been the interpreter anyway, so it saves time if I just do it here instead. <laughs> you got a point there. Thanks again. Right. I'm a police officer. You can talk to me about whatever it is you're having trouble with. Great. I find someone who I can finally converse with. My name is Tanamura. I'm with the Tokyo Metro Police Department. Who are you? I'm Nair. This is my first trip to Japan and I still haven't got my bearings quite yet. Nair. Nice to meet you. I'm guessing you're from Southeast Asia? Anyways, you're looking for someone, right? That's right. Well, actually I'm a detective too. Wait, you? You're a detective? Mm. That's right. I followed a criminal to Japan to bring him to justice. Can you just do that? Do the Japanese police know what you're up to here? I contacted the Japanese police before I left. They're supposed to be helping. But once I got here, everyone seemed so busy. No one would help me with my investigation. Oh, um, I see. Everything's in a bit of a mess right now, so I bet not everyone knows you're even here. I was told I would be given an interpreter. And I'm guessing you didn't get that either? I apologize for the inconvenience. It's not your fault. I'm just happy to finally have to talk to someone I can understand. Glad to be of assistance. But I have a little dilemma. We have a permission to investigate, but we don't have the authority to make arrests. In Japan, only the Japanese police are allowed to make arrests. Mm, you got a point there. But it's not our investigation. We can't make an arrest without sufficient evidence. There is evidence! That's why my colleagues and I came to Japan hoping for some help from you guys. Colleagues? They're out at the embassy right now. Mr. Tanamura, would you come with me for a bit? Well, I did have something I needed to be doing, but I guess we could take time to do this in the meantime. What is this place? We don't have cell phones that work in Japan right now, so this is our rend rendezvous point. I see now. That's why you couldn't follow that officer to the police station. The criminal we're seeking won't be in Japan for long, so we have to investigate along with the embassy and the Japanese police. Mr. Tanamura, would you please help us? We have to catch our criminal. Me? Mm. Yes, I beg of you. We'll take care of the investigation, but we need you to come along to make the arrest. I'm not sure. It sounds like more trouble than it's worth. But I guess the station will make me do it later even if I refuse now. If that's the case, it'd be easier for me if I did this of my own accord. Alright, I'll help. Really? Thank you, thank you, Mr. Tanamura! By the way, I have no problem arresting the criminal, but you guys don't have guns, right? Isn't that dangerous? I don't usually carry a gun. A police officer's job is to catch criminals, not kill them. If that's true, you've done a good job at staying alive. Don't you have dangerous cases? I may not look it, but I pack a pretty strong punch. Strong, stronger than any of the gangs here. R really? I wouldn't have known. I can't win a head-on slugfest with men, though. I use their own strength against them. So you're good at parrying, I guess. I prefer countering simple brawls t too, so I can understand your logic. Oh yeah? We should try sparring together then. Sparring? Yeah! That way we can share techniques and help each other get better. Sparring is important no matter what martial art you use. I don't know if my style could be called a martial art. But, uh, alright, while we spar, you can update me on the progress of the investigation. Sounds great! Just come here anytime and I'll fill you in. Okay, when I have the time then. So, wait, are you my master? Are you going to be my new master during this... Ah, that's kind of cool, actually. Oh, here we go. Have you heard of Revelations? Revelations? Yeah. I heard there are times that you can have epic revelations just by witnessing certain special events throughout the city. P 
people like us that train regularly can use the insp inspiration to discover a new techniques. Revelations, eh? I think I understand, but I'm not sure I know how it works. Then you, when you witness some sort of decisive moment or incident, try sketching it. Or, at least, that's what someone told me. I've been keeping memos of the various new techniques I've seen since coming to Japan, and I haven't... And I already have some technique-worthy material. That's interesting. Maybe I'll try using the notepad I was carrying next time I see something. So, Akiyama uses a cell phone, Saijima uses a woodblock, and we use a notepad. Uh, notepad, eh? Makes sense, we're a police officer. I mean, it's not as great as the woodchuck and, um, the woodblock and hammer and sickle. Not hammer and sickle, hammer and, um, nail, but, um, still pretty good. Okay, so we got our master location now. Which is in Little Asia, so interesting. And I'm also guessing that, um, no, sorry, not memos, uh, email. That she's going to e email me the... Yeah, okay, she's going to email me the revelations, similar to Akiyama style. That is very cool, actually. Okay, and this is the rendezvous point. Well, I'm glad to have seen that. I'll go, Masa! Masa! It's my dad! What, what happened? Jesus Christ, all the people are having all the problems all at once! I took him! What? What, what do you mean? I came to into Homeland and said something like, Where's Nadine? Do, do you know who they are? No, oh, I think they headed somewhere off San Rio Avenue. Please, Massa, save my dad. Uh, don't worry, I'll take care of it. You get back to the restaurant, okay? No, I'm going to. <laughs> I had a feeling you'd say that. Fine, but we've got to hurry. Keep it up. Thank you, Massa. By the way, how are you feeling? Are you tired? Here, drink these. I got salmon or eggs, I got toughness Z. Jeez, you giving me free health items? Thanks! Now let's get going. I'm right behind you. Jesus Christ, I'm getting all of the sub stories. And are you actually going to follow me? This is no time to move to to somewhere to Okay. So wait, Zhao is actually your father? Interesting. So Semra and Avenue, where is that? So we might as well do that right now. Um There we go, right there. So, don't worry, don't worry, May, um, May, we shall try and find your father, because I am a officer on duty, even though this, I don't think I'm doing this an official business, and I'm not entirely sure if, um, Tanamura would like to be, um, like to be pulled being an officer, but, you know, it's the thought that counts. Okay, so, Avenue, 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 um, somewhere around here, maybe? There's no time to be making details. Okay, so somewhere around here then. Okay, guess not. Um, Zhao! Zhao! Where are you? There you are! Zhao! I'm here to rescue you! How many times do I have to tell you? I'd never heard of a woman named Nadine. <laughs> We're in no hurry, old man. How about we take a trip to our office to jog your memory there? I, I have nothing to say to you. Get the uh, hell out of my way. Hey, guess what? The police have a name for this kind of incident. It's called abduction. Who are you? Doesn't matter. Just hand over Zhao. This is dangerous, Mo Mei Hui. Get, stay back. Fine. Shall we get started? God damn. Getting all of the extras. Let's take out these shady men. Although, they do look pretty classy in their black suits, have to admit. And look at that! We got Zhao um, screaming for us in the background there. Don't worry, Zhao, we will save you. And uh, do you, would you would you mind helping us? You know, would very much appreciate it. No? Okay, well, I guess I'll do this myself. And you know what? I just remembered, I have 15 ability points which I need to um, spend because that's a lot of ability points and I would very much appreciate using them. So I should probably get around to doing that at some point. Anyway. You're under arrest! God, that feels satisfying every time I do that. Just stay there when I'm wriggling pain, why don't you? So let's just take these guys out nice and simple like, take you over to the bar, and yeah. You're gonna be getting a headache after all that, buddy. 
Okay, oh god, okay, this guy is pissed. Okay, there we go. I call that one the Spine Tingler. But not as bad as the Spine Buster. Are you hurt? No, I'm fine. Uh, sorry about this. Those guys were looking for a woman named Nadine? You know her? Nadine. She came here from the Philippines to make a little money. But uh, the authorities found out she was working illegally and now they're trying to chase her down. And then she sought help from the Asian Gateway, am I right? Right. She was actually at the restaurant when those guys showed up. Lucky she was in the back room and got the hell out of, of there when she heard the noise. Hmm, it's got, excuse me. I see. So, who were those guys? They're definitely not the authorities. My guess is that they're traffickers of illegal immigrants. They're afraid if Nadine gets arrested, the police will find out about them. I get the picture. Anyway, I doubt Nadine will come anywhere near this area now. It's going to be hard to yeah. find her. I might have no way. You have some info? Well, uh, there's this fortune teller over on Tenkaichi Street. She might be able to help you track Nadine down. Huh? A fortune teller? Is this another one of your jokes, Zhao? She's no joke. She's almost always right. Kind of freaky, really. Sounds sketchy. Whatever. If you recommend it, I guess I've got nothing to lose. Where was she again? On uh, Tentaichi Street, right near a host club called Stardust. Got it. Guess I'll go get my fortune read then. So damn, we got a bunch of sub stories I think now. So if we just look over here, we should see we got two sub stories and plus that master's um, side quest um, investigation that's going on as well. So interesting. We got a bunch of stuff that we need to do before we go to the car park. So I think we'll take the time in order to do the sub stories, methinks.